Hi. Uh, okay, first of all, again, I'm sorry I haven't been here for a long time. This video is going to be a little different, as I'm sure you'll see very soon. A couple quick things. Um, I am in a different room. You probably can't really tell um, because it's still just a dorm room. But um, my roommate is now an RA. If you don't know what that means, it basically means that she's in charge of like a small section of our hallway and it means that she gets free housing and I get like 10% off of housing, which is pretty cool. So we're basically just across the street from where I lived last semester, but it took a while to move everything over here. But it's pretty good, I like it. Um, it's just a different layout, but it's pretty good. I also got a haircut. I managed to go a whole year without cutting my hair, but I couldn't do it anymore. That I haven't been posting anything or really responding to many things in a while and figured I would just tell you why. Um, honestly, it's just because I've been really sad lately. I don't really like to talk about it because it just makes me sad, but I figured you guys should just know. Over the past couple months, I have sort of been seeing this guy and over Christmas break, a lot of really bad things happened <laughs> and now I basically I never cry I'm not one to you know cry in front of people because I don't like them worrying about me but I had a couple of really really bad days where I could not stop crying and it just hurt worse than anything that I have ever experienced and it was just pretty bad um I am okay now, um, I am trying to get used to it, I have basically been living with this guy for maybe four months, so it's kind of weird to get back to campus and not, I mean, like live across the street from him and not be there, especially when I'm really good friends with his roommate and I have a class with him and it's just, it's a little weird to get used to, but I am okay and I'm trying to get back into the swing of doing things and not thinking about it and not questioning like everything but yeah that's kind of why I was really AWOL for a while but um yeah <laughs> um I've also it's also been hard because I mean I'm, I'm taking more classes this semester than I've ever taken because I'm considering double majoring and honestly I think that the reasoning behind that is that the more schoolwork I do, the kind of less I have to think about things, and that's not me pushing, like, my problems aside, you know? I, I can never stop thinking, I can never stop worrying, that's just the way I am. But I figure that if I have at least some sort of obligation that I have to do, that I'm paying for to do, meaning school, that at least that's some time that I'll spend not worrying. So the point is, I'm a linguistics major, I'm planning on double majoring in geography, and if I want to do that I have to take um, 18 hours this semester, which is another extra class, which isn't really too hard, it's just that I'm taking three linguistics classes this semester instead of one, and so it's a little confusing with all the overlap and everything, but I think, I think it'll be okay, it's just I have to get used to that too little extra thing, especially now that I'm in a dorm that does not have a cafeteria, so I have to kind of walk across the street. It's just a little extra effort. Anyway, my point is that I wanted to say I am sorry for not contributing as much as I should have or talking to you guys as much or not even, I mean, I haven't even been as much in the whole nerdfighter community, like, even at all. We, my university has just recently gotten our foot in the ground making University Nerdfighters an official organization and I am one of the people that actually started that and I haven't gone to the last couple meetings which I feel really bad about. I just haven't felt like getting up and going which makes me feel really bad because when you're in a hole of sadness that is so bad that even Nerdfighteria can't get you out of, that's pretty bad and I don't know, I mean I am, I am coming up slowly, it's just, it's a process, <laughs> but, um, 
I just wanted you all to know that I am doing my best to come back. I am getting back into North Vicaria and getting back into Nail, which are basically two of my biggest passions ever. But yeah, I am back and I am okay now. And I have to go get breakfast and read this book about phonological sound patterns. It's gonna be lots of fun. Yay! I hope you're all having a good day. And I've recently realized that we've all known each other for about a year now because I remember that one of the first things that we did was send each other Valentine's last year and it's almost Valentine's Day again. And so I'm happy that you can all be my Valentine because I am now one of those girls who is hateful and vengeful of Valentine's Day because she has no boyfriend to send her a Valentine. So we should all send each other hearts so that we can remember that the world is a nice place. I'm going to go get breakfast now even though it is 3 p.m. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, I will see you guys soon, and my New Year's resolution is to do what my t-shirt says, which is, well, this is Dream On Dreamer, but that sounds kind of depressing in a weird way. My New Year's resolution is to dream big, and to do what my t-shirt says, which is, keep calm on DFTVA. Good. Okay. I'm going to silence myself now, and I will wish you all a good day. I wish I had something cool to show you on the way out, but I really don't, so, um, yeah. Cha-ching! Bye, guys. Love you all.